Welcome to the latest update program. The topic of discussion is coral frozen for the first time. Recently, scientists working in Australia have successfully trialed a new method for freezing and storing coral larvae. The trials involved scientists from AIMS, the Smithsonian National Zoo and Conservation Biology Institute, the Great Barrier Reef Foundation and the Taronga Conservation Society, Australia. These trials were conducted as part of the reef restoration and adaptation program. This successful trial could help rewild reefs threatened by climate change. Scientists used the cryomesh to freeze coral larvae at the Australian Institute of Marine Sciences or AIMS. The new lightweight cryomesh can be manufactured cheaply and better preserves coral. The coral had been collected from the reef for the trial, which coincided with a brief annual spawning window. Cryogenically frozen coral can be stored and later reintroduced to the wild, but the current process requires sophisticated equipment, including lasers. Now, information about Great Barrier Reef. The Great Barrier Reef is a site of remarkable variety and beauty on the northeast coast of Australia. It contains the world's largest collection of coral reefs with 400 types of coral, 1,500 species of fish and 4,000 types of mollusk. It also holds great scientific interest as the habitat of species such as the dugong that is sea cow and the large green turtle which are threatened with extinction.